worst basketball. Yes. Uh, this time last summer, I was, you know, falling back in love with the game, trying to get my head back on straight, and, uh, you know, kind of a little nervous because I'm about to be the leader of this team, and I just played my worst season. It was just kind of a lot going on, but right now I am in a great spot. Um, you know, it didn't end the season as well as we wanted, but I felt like I, you know, I, I was playing my best basketball individually. Um, so I just need to keep that going, and I, I feel good. I did keep that going while I, I was here for five weeks, so I'm proud of myself for, you know, shaking back and, I'm excited for you guys to see this first, you know, finishing product. How do you, <laughs> you like to be here and, and be able to say that? I feel confident. I feel like I played after, like you said, last year, it was a whole different ball game for you. It feels really good. <laughs> Not even going to lie. Um, because I've been I've been on the other end, and it is a horrible feeling, but the fact that I, you know, worked my way back up is a great feeling. How, how do you think that experience uh, informs your leadership? Uh, the experience for uh, 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 having those lows and coming back and feeling oh, fine. Yeah, that, uh, it means a lot because I can connect with, you know, if, if any of my teammates are down bad, like, I can truly, genuinely connect with them, and I have gotten myself out of it, so I can, you know, help them with that. Um, you know, I don't know. If, I guess a lot of players go through the ups and downs, but I can genuinely help my teammates, and I feel like they would could appreciate that, that I can connect with them on that level. How do you maintain that? Just, how do you maintain that? So I keep from falling back into the same Staying in the gym. <laughs> That's the only way, like, you just have to put in the work for you to have the... Confidence and just work ethic, you just have to stay in the gym. You mentioned that you watched the Arizona game for the first time before you came after mm -hmm. the summer session. Why was it important to you to watch that game before you got here? Um, well, I, it took me some time to watch it, but I felt like I needed to before I got here. Um, just to, like, light that fire again, to see, like, what actually happened, and to feel that pain again, so that I can, you know, work my hardest. This is why we're here. This is why we work hard. Oh, sorry. So we won't be in that position anymore. So I feel like it was important for me to watch that game again. Mm -hmm. Nika's, Nika's talked about seeing a different level from the three the, the three seniors. Can you just talk about what you guys have done different? Um, I mean, we got a chip on our shoulder. Um, we It was our responsibility that we lost the Arizona game, us three. Um, and... We don't want to feel that again, so we're going to do whatever it takes to not be back in that position. So we got to change a few things, and I feel like we all did. And and kind of like are. what he said, unfinished business this year? Yeah. No other phrase. Uh, unfinished business. <laughs> yeah. Your preference is easy. Easy. Um, yeah, she's, she's, her shot is very quick. It's kind of like Paige. Um, She's very good. I, I could see, you know, some of myself in her. Um, but she got injured a couple weeks ago, so I didn't really get to, you know, get the full of experience. But she's going to be good. And Paige, I mean, I, I know she hasn't really been able to do much, but, mm -hmm. you know, she kind of. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Paige is still her goofy self, um, doing her rehab and, you know, on the court. Uh, she's always there encouraging. There this page, <laughs> she'll be back. How about Caroline? What you seen from her? Caroline, um, she's she's impressed me. I didn't know what to expect for her, but she's really good. Um, she can shoot. When she gets on a roll, is she doesn't miss. Um, and she's very like deceivingly long. Like I've shot a couple times and she blocked it because yeah. her arms were so long. I'm like, oh, um, I know. Oh, extend our arms, but yeah, she's gonna be good. Obviously, you know, all the freshmen have a lot to learn, you know, because we haven't had like real practice or anything. But I feel like the freshman class is gonna be good. Talk about what it's like to have another experienced big to go alongside live mm -hmm. with Dorka. Yeah, I think they work really well together. Um, you can definitely tell Dorka is experienced, um, she's been here before, and she just came in and she gelled right. Right along with the rest of us, um, so I'm I'm very excited to watch her and Liv um, work together. How do you spend the rest of the summer? Oh yeah, I was gonna ask the same thing. Sorry. Yes, yeah, uh, you're going home this week, I imagine. No. Yeah, How do you spend I am. The rest of the um, working out, <laughs> um, enjoying my time at home uh, with my family before we come back in August.